Jesus. Overcome any obstacle that this world throws at you. So me, myself, as I told him earlier, I grew up, my father was a heroin addict. I don't know if y'all ever listen to old school music. Y'all ever heard of a group called Tower of Power? Yeah. Anybody here? Yeah. Okay, well my dad and my uncle started that group. My pops was a drummer. Wow. My uncle's still the saxophonist and the leader of the band. But my pops got hooked on heroin yes, sir. and that lifestyle. My dad ended up OD'ing on heroin when I was 18 years old. They found him in Vallejo, California at the Vallejo Inn in room 111. I overdosed on heroin. So that crushed my soul. My mom was an alcoholic, did crank, and then when Crystal came out, she switched, she skipped the Crystal. So that's the environment that I came up in, in Richmond, California, out in the Bay Area. Yes, sir. I was molested as a child. Yes, we moved from pillar to post. I know what it's like to have nothing but hate and rage and anger. I was the only white boy on the block, so I always had to do more to prove myself. Yeah, yeah. I was the gunner yes, in the hood. Uh -huh. I was the protector. Yeah. See, God put that love in me. I was just using it the wrong way. Yeah. Thank you, Lord. Amen. Hallelujah. The enemy sees these God-given qualities that are inside of all of us, and he manipulates us. Yeah. 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 The word says that he has all power. So if he has all, who has none? If he has all, who has none? Right? And Christ gave us that authority, y'all. Amen. We have to know who we are in Christ. So I came up in that household. I was gang banging by the age of 12. Wow. Man, you name it, man. I ended up, when my pops OD'd is when I first accepted Christ into my life. Yes, sir. I was on fire for like six months, but I didn't surrender everything in my heart. Sons and daughters of God, brothers and sisters, let me tell you right now. Yes. Do not keep these vain um, imaginations and dreams inside you that you want to do what you want to do. When you come to God, you got to come to him being real, being like, Lord, I surrender my life and my plans. It's no longer my life. Because if you hold on to that, the enemy will know that and he'll see that and he'll use it against you. Cause inside my twin towers, they done crashed down. Ground zero with no hero in sight to be found. Tormented by the terrors of this loneliness. I'm in a room with people feeling so alone in this. I'm so lost and confused, why must I come through this? I feel like hopes are missed, dealing with this hopelessness. 